When we take care of our garden, one of the simplest and most effective ways to improve plant health is by using what we already have. Weeds, charcoal, compost, and a few natural ingredients. Start by walking through your garden bed and pulling out all those unwanted weeds. It might seem like a small task, but it does more than just make the bed look neat. It gives your veggie plants room to breathe, more sunlight to reach their leaves, and access to the water and nutrients they need to grow strong. Don't toss those weeds aside though, they're not just waste. They're the key to creating a rich, living fertilizer that your plants will absolutely love. Once you've gathered the weeds, find a large container and pour in about 10 liters of rainwater. Rainwater is the best choice because it's natural, soft, and free from harsh chemicals. It already carries traces of nutrients that make it better than tap water. Now, take those weeds and submerge them in the water. As they soak, they'll start to release all the minerals and nutrients they absorbed from the soil. What you're doing here is recycling the goodness back into a form your garden can use again. Now it's time to bring in the magic ingredient, crushed charcoal. Sprinkle a good amount into the container. Charcoal has an incredible ability to hold on to nutrients and beneficial microbes, slowly releasing them to the plants when they need it. It also helps keep the mix fresh by absorbing any unpleasant smells. The charcoal will slowly settle at the bottom, acting like a nutrient sponge that strengthens the final fertilizer. Next. Add a few spoonfuls of molasses. Think of this as food for the good microbes that are about to come alive in your mixture. Molasses is full of natural sugars that help beneficial bacteria multiply quickly. These microbes are the real workers. They break down the weeds, turning the raw materials into plant-ready nutrients. After that, toss in a few handfuls of compost. The compost adds millions of living organisms, bacteria, fungi, and enzymes that will help speed up the breakdown process. Mix everything well so the weeds, charcoal, molasses, and compost blend together. Once mixed, cover the container. You don't need to seal it tightly, just cover it loosely to keep out insects while allowing air to circulate. Let this mixture sit for seven to 10 days. During this time, nature does its work quietly. The liquid will darken, the smell will turn earthy, and the mixture will come alive with microscopic life. When the days are up, open the lid and take a look. What you have now is a powerful natural fertilizer concentrated with nutrients and beneficial microbes. Before using it, you'll need to dilute it, about one part of the liquid to 10 parts of water. This keeps it gentle enough for your plants. Once diluted, pour it around the roots of your plants or spray it on their leaves. They'll soak it up fast, and within days, you'll notice a visible difference. Greener leaves, faster growth, and stronger stems. What's beautiful about this process is how simple and sustainable it is. Everything you used came from your garden and kitchen. Weeds, charcoal, compost, a bit of molasses, and rainwater. Nothing is wasted. Instead, you've turned what was once garden debris into a nutrient powerhouse. This mixture not only feeds your plants, but also improves the soil, increases microbial activity, and keeps your garden ecosystem healthy and alive.
With a little patience and a few natural ingredients, you've created a living fertilizer that keeps your garden thriving, all from the materials nature gave you for free.